Hello ladies and gentlemen, motorsport fans, Campbell Soups back here on the Campbell Soups Gaming Shady Motorsports YouTube channel. I hope you guys are staying safe out there. Once again, Happy New Year, Happy 2021. Hopefully it'll, it'll be a much better year for everybody. As always, be sure to hit the like button, hit the subscribe button if you guys want to see more Real Racing 3 content. And we are about to get started on track day. And with that being said, let's get into it. And of course, um, by completing track day, this is a 5 day special event. This is required PR, so hopefully it won't be too hard like the Spanish Grand Prix again. There, obviously, the reward will be the McLaren's uh, 765 LT and up to 75 gold. So let's get into it. Okay, and it is uh, continuous, so goal number one, to begin the review, take the LT on a two-lap cruise. Mm, easy enough. And once again, for the next two to three hours, we have instant servicing and instant R&D. Before I get into that, let's look at the paint they got. They got six colors. We got the baby blue, or light blue, whatever you all want to call it. Not a fan of this one, to be honest. We got black. Well, you can never go wrong with black. Black looks good on any car. So, like, say if you're at the dealership, you're buying a new car, you can't decide on which color uh, you want to buy for your new car. Just... Go with the default, go with black. You can never go wrong with black. Uh, I don't know what color this one is. Like a bluish, greenish color. Again, not really a fan of this one. Oh yeah, red. You, you, you can never go red. Um... On this McLaren or any sports car in general. Hell, I actually have a, like a Red Master 3 and it looks really good. So, depending on the car, you can never go wrong with red too. And then you got white. White looks good on this one too, but it, I'm just, me personally, I'm not a fan of white cars. In terms of like white cars, they just get dirty way too easily. And, like, you'll be spending a lot of money at the car wash, so. And we're going to go with the usual. We're going to go with uh, three across the board. Twenty one out of the twenty eight, so again the usual three across the board. Complete two laps to get a feel for the car. Okay. In terms of the interior, 
uh, again, not much change. Like, this card definitely just reminds me of the McLaren 720S. And it drives like it too. I mean, I could be wrong, but for me personally, it just feels like there's really no significant change to the car. Alright, we're gonna do a little, uh... First lap, I kinda played it safe. Let's test the downforce on this car. I thought that was only a proper test. Oh, actually, maybe I might be wrong. This car actually, uh... This car's down for us. One more time. Oh yeah, this car's got down for us. Okay, I'm, okay, I'm liking it. Okay, there's one advantage over the 720S. Good cornering speed. Goal number two, hit a target speed of 276 three times in the next two laps. Goal number three, draft for 5,000 meters. Oh, my good old friend Amid. Or, or Hamed, or whatever y'all pronounce his name as.
Final goal for stage 1. I've invited racers and enthusiasts to challenge you in the LT. Okay. Win. Alright, that's going to be it for now. I hope you guys are enjoying what you're seeing so far. You guys already know what to do. Be sure, be sure to follow me on social media and on Gaming Console. I will leave those in the description. And until then, y'all take it easy, stay safe, stay positive out there, and I will see you in Stage 2.